Welcome to Steph Reacts. We are going to react to another episode of Craig Fox on Caffeine. But before we get into it, your daily facts for today. Did you know? Did you know that German chocolate cake was first invented in Texas? I did not know that, but now you do. But before we get into the video, speaking about Texas, my heart and prayers goes out to the families and friends affected at this time. Our prayers goes out to you guys. My apologies. Let's go. So big come with the cocaine already in. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up, guys? It is fat time. We're going to hear Bilu. We're going to hear from Billy. We're going to hear from Ronnie Jordan. And hopefully, Doughboy. If we have any surprise guests, it will be a surprise. I'm not sure at this point. But it's going to Why be a blast. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. Welcome to another episode of Roast This. I'm your host, Brandon Lewis, and this is the comedic show where we talk about everything that's going on in the culture. I'm never by myself. I'm always with my brothers, my brethren. Starting from the top to the right to the bottom to the left. In my introduction, did I say Roast? Did I say Craig Podcast? If I did, I cannot remember, but my apologies. This is Roast This. This is another episode of Roast This. All the way from Atlanta, Georgia, man. Y'all give it up for Ronnie Jordan. Bam, 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 bam. Well, What's up, well, How's everybody? Underneath Ronnie, just landing in LAX, man, getting his shine on, looking like a real capo. All the way from Texas, y'all give it up for Billy Sorrells. Billy! <laughs> Billy Isley. Hello. Hello. La, 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 la. And last but not least, all the way from Sacramento, California, aka Sacramento, y'all give it up for the finals MVP runner up. Uh, Doughboy, aka Doel Embiid. What up, though? Doel Embiid in the I business. Like that one. I like that one, though. Y'all know why they call me? Y'all know why they call me Doel Embiid? Why? I almost thought um, B. Lewis saying the finals MVP runner up for roast me. I was like, never, because you know CP wanted for episode for season four. Craig wanted for season three. And I don't think Doughboy had a strong enough case to even be a runner-up, in my opinion. Because I'm a big nigga, and I should have been named MVP way back in the day. You feel? Okay. That was hella right. long, but I feel you. <laughs> I get it. I kind of get it. I, I thought you were saying, I thought you were telling us you was African. I was like, okay. And last but not <laughs> least, my dog who always keep us running, he's never seen, but he's always in between. Y'all give it up for my nigga, Dean. What's up, y'all? Happy Tuesday, y'all. Roast me day, man. We having good, having a good old time. We're gonna go over a few clips today for uh for the roast me uh uh season five episode three. We got a few clips to look at today. We got a few things to look at, man. It should be dope. Should be dope. It should be fun, man. Yeah, it should be dope. I'm man. with it. I'm with it. Well, yeah, well, man. let's get to it then. You know what I'm saying? I'm glad to see you know everybody here. You know, mm -hmm. Noel and B. How you doing? You looking <laughs> good. That? You looking like real? You got you, you got your diabetic sauce on today. You, you know you driven. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> hey, what? 
<laughs> hey, boy, you got them goddamn them uh them hearing test uh hearing uh headphones on today, boy. You got to put your finger up. Which side is the sound coming to? Put your finger up. Which side? Hold on. <laughs> it's over here. You should go to the library and get the test done. Shut your ass up. I hate your hat, nigga. <laughs> I know you, I you got a harmonica underneath it. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah, I hey, know. Joe, just keep it simple, right? I hate your outfit, nigga. <laughs> I hate your whole ass outfit, nigga. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah. You you hate my outfit about as much as your ankles hate your knees. It's like, man, he's the one on worth shit. <laughs> Show ass up, see, nigga. What's up, Ronnie? You know what I'm saying? What's happening, I, man? How you I was, feeling, bro? I was telling these good people to watch us on Caffeine Network. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to man, everybody you watching know, on the feed. See, you know, I got a wisdom. I got a. Oh, go ahead. Now, what you say? I got a wisdom tool pulled today on the on the left hand side. So oh, I, can man, eat, I can only eat soft foods. And they got a smart, and they got a smart mouth. <laughs> he got a what? He got a smart mouth. He got his wisdom too poor. <laughs> yeah, I just got my shit pulled today, man. That shit, it didn't, it wasn't too bad though. It was huge though. It was, it was a big tooth. Did they give you them per, them them future pills, them Percocets, and Molly Percocets? Nah, I don't, I don't be nigga. I'll be like, nah, nigga, just let me deal with it. <laughs> hey, ain't no way. If, if you you mean to tell me you got a wisdom too poor and it and, and and you ain't got no medicine? Oh, that's I don't. I don't. Bro, I, 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 I okay. got an addicted personality, bro. I don't. I don't really like taking pills like that. Like I'll be like, nah, I'm cool. <laughs> it don't hurt that bad anyway, too. So I'm straight. Yeah, that's you that's another you, sign. That's that's another sign of obesity when your teeth just come in the fuck out. Wisdom teeth just hopping out of the bitch. Like, yeah, I'm about done here. I don't need all I can do. <laughs> that, that nigga, that nigga teeth punched the job and clocked out. He was like, yeah, I'm done. <laughs> I got three out of four out, so I got one left on the top one right here. It's my last one. Hey, it in there. Billy, Billy is the ghost of Roastmas Pass, goddamn. That nigga <laughs> <laughs> yeah. come here roasting everybody, looking better than everybody. What the hell? Look out, boy. You know, oh, nigga, tomorrow is going to be the same thing. You know what I'm saying? Oh, man? no, nigga. I'm on I, don't your know, ass, nigga. I don't know, man. I don't know, man. I don't know. Oh, oh yeah, boy. Billy, I'm going to tell you what about that. He get pissed. <laughs> oh, oh, okay, okay. Well, we're gonna let him in, man. And, uh, coming to the podcast directly in. I wouldn't say the class, but my nigga already in the motherfucking class. All the way from the west side of Detroit, where they say Didi. Y'all give it up for my nigga Chris. <laughs> CP. <laughs> 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 what up, what up, what up, no. what up player? No. What up, what no. is, bro? Right. Hey, man. Up, boy? I'm backstage listening. Goddamn. So them, so them wisdom teeth. Said, fuck it, huh, no boy? It nigga, said, fuck it. <laughs> it tapped out. It said, time out. This nigga be crunching Skittles. This nigga be biting Jolly Ranchers. <laughs> this nigga be biting Jolly Ranchers. We are no man, no, no, yo. We are the fuck out of here. It took them motherfuckers clearly out. I only got one left. Hey, them, hey, you know the nigga team was so ready to leave. They know which way I go to get up out of here. This way or that way. Oh, that way. Oh, like, hey, God, hey, Billy, <laughs> Billy. This nigga team couldn't even finish the sentence. They were so hurt. I'm going to tell you like this. One time, this motherfucker took a cow zone. Let me tell you that. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that nigga team that nigga, that nigga was talking to us. He said, y'all can deal with this bullshit if you want to. I'm done with this shit. I'm out. I'm done. Yeah, you know what? No, fuck out of that, man. I'm out of here. He's he been a lot of time. Front team. Y'all going to say? You know what? You're front. So that's your part of right now. <laughs> That ain't what you said last night when this nigga was asleep. You said, fuck this snore and sleep after you, kid. I got to get the fuck out. That ain't what you said. <laughs> Shut your ass up, nigga. But that night, he took that motherfucking cow zone, and he rolled that bitch up like a blunt, and he just kept fighting that bitch. And, but no, get off me. He kept fighting that motherfucker. <laughs> Get off me. Then he walked it down <laughs> off. It's molar move, molar. Then he walked it down with all the goddamn nine later. Fuck this nigga. <laughs> oh, my <Finish> God. It. <laughs> Who has a cavity? He said, is that a cavity or does your tooth have an asshole? I said, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Shut yeah. your ass up. Hey, Billy, where you going to your nigga house? <laughs> That was, that was solid. Hey, Come Billy, on. Billy, Billy, Billy looks like. Turn the light off. Hey, Billy looked like Doughboy Tooth Lawyer. Like, you know what I'm <laughs> Billy on his way to fight that motherfucking case. Billy, like, no, no, because he, he deserves compensation for this shit. <laughs> Did he tell you about the cow zone? Oh, no, you don't know that. Where's this cow zone coming from? 
Calzone. Oh, this guy, calzone bro. he had, man, it was murder. You understand me? Murder. Oh, man. Did he tell you about the calzone? That's funny. That's, that's, calzone. Calzone. that's funny. That's that's funny. Calzone had two cookies in it. What the fuck? Disrespecting <laughs> <laughs> the calzone. Put a cookie in a calzone? No boy pull up like, uh, is, is the milk take machine working? Yes, sir. All right, cool. I want a milkshake Big Mac. <laughs> I know y'all can do it. Just the one on Alameda said they can do it. Y'all can do it. It ain't against the rules. No, what Red, the Big Flurry, Red, Addy. Hey, not, uh, <laughs> hey, not Billy out, Dean, and then bring him back. Yeah, oh, not, yeah I'll talk about it there. Oh, my goodness. God oh, damn. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Way to come in swinging, CP. Good to, good to have you right. back, brother. You the one came in with a shirt that said cookies. Nigga, calm down. <laughs> Nigga, we know where the delivery's going. The little, little girls all over the city. Shit. <laughs> 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 Nigga, that's funny as hell. It's Girl Scouts everywhere. Like, man, hey, one of my top, uh, one of my top distros, his name is Dover. What <laughs> the distro? The distro. All right, real quick, all right, real quick, let me pay some bills, man. Right now, if you're watching this live stream oh, on man. YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, or any other platform besides caffeine. We are now about to cut the live stream. So that's right. If you're hearing my voice on any other platform besides Caffeine, go ahead right now, on over to your app store, download Caffeine, make an account, which is absolutely free, follow all depth, follow each and every person on this live stream, at Comedian CP, at I Am Doughboy, at Ronnie Jordan, at Big Bank Lewis, and also uh, tell a friend to tell a friend, man, to watch us each and every Tuesday and watch Roast Me, the Classroom Edition, Season 5, every other Wednesday, live on Caffeine. Do it. What's up? All hey, right. yo, boy, with yes, the buckle. Yes, sir. Wonderful, wonderful episode. I think this is episode three when CP returned. And I think they will be discussing and talking about it. But, yeah. Episode 5 to me was one of the best episodes that was aired so far on Caffeine. It was really, really interesting. And yeah, I really, really enjoyed it to be honest. And every, everyone everyone in the comment section is saying that episode 5 is really, really up there for the most interesting. Good show. Oh, come on, man. Come on, man. Go go put in the application to be B Lou Sarsi. <laughs> hey man, look. Hey man, look. I don't know how much chewing you do. I don't know how much chewing you do, man, but if you're looking for a good solid to they go turn their back on you. I done been in the trenches. Oh, I did, <laughs> the trenches. I did I war, war ice cream. I did, uh, I did the Oreo finasco of 08. <laughs> It's one yeah. tube that ain't going back in there. It's one tube by light of blood up like I ain't doing it. I can't do it. <laughs> can't do it, my boy. No. Nope. Well shit. that nigga got a tube about to move to Atlanta right now. This shit, this nigga in the airport. <laughs> All right, let's talk about it, fellas, real quick. Let's, let's get this show r- 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 rolling. Uh, we're going to talk about it right now, man. Episode three. Is this right, Demons? Episode three? Yeah, this is season five, episode three. Season five, episode three, man. My man, nigga set it off. Came with that big nigga like a smooth owl. Shout out to my nigga Chris. Set <laughs> it off, Jones, man. Go set ahead, Clip. We're going to watch this show again. Go ahead, mute you. Go ahead, mute you. Uh, no, y- uh, y- y'all should be okay. Y'all should be okay. okay, That's okay. What we this nigga cheekbones need nipples on them. God damn. <laughs> God damn it, CP. All right, here we go. I only, I only hit blunts after y'all. When Billy hit that blunt, your lip might fuck around and get pregnant. I can't fuck with you. Yep. Uh, after you say something evil, you hear this in your head. <laughs> <laughs> So that was the first clip. Would y'all think about it? I think it was I think Brandon, I think Brandon Lewis make it worse when you get in tow up. Be like, oh, oh yeah, that his laughs make it ten times worse. 
This nigga right here. Oh my god, he's killing you. That nigga pull that whole side two space out. He'll give a fuck when he laughs. Ah! <laughs> 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 that looks me hurt people's feelings even more. Yeah. You do. Nick, on your head. Nick. Okay. All right. Well, the, the uh, I mean uh, this, this is the clip. I, I'm talking about as soon as I walked in, it was yeah, like Yeah, get Ronnie, you ready? You know what's about to happen. I'm, it's I'm the way sure. you walked in. Like, you yeah. should have just bust through the door like Kool-Aid. It would have been more respect. <laughs> you me too polite. Like, hey, everybody. All right, come on. <laughs> All right, you ready? <laughs> Let's do it. We know where it's about to go. Sit at. Hey, where he gonna sit at? Yeah, like, bro, this is like the lunch room. Let me go. Let me go over here to the seat. You gotta give it to Ronnie. Go ahead, Ronnie. All right, all right. No, no, no. Don't go over there, brother. Over here. Hey, Ronnie Joy, go to Burger King. Like, <laughs> let me get a number one, or I'ma kill myself. <laughs> Episode three of Roast Me was one of the best. This was the highlight of the. Um, the jokes that CP told. This was the highlight. I remember this now. I'm not yeah. praying for shit. Give me a number one. I'm going to kill myself. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Brandon Lewis. Brandon Lewis hates you. <laughs> 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 you got to get Hey, they did a friend hand shake and shit. Nigga, don't do a friend dab on me. You got to let that one go. He got it. Uh, you gotta let it go. Man, Thoughts, it, it was that an nigga, honor. He is always cooking, bro. That nigga, he don't turn it off. He's always mm. loaded and ready to go, man. So my first time in the in classroom. Just... I'm, I'm, already, I'm a mortal clip right now. Thank you. My first four feet. Ah, <laughs> 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 I was like, oh shit. Ronnie, Ronnie, hey, Ronnie did the shit, and I, I seen him. We was backstage, and you know what's funny is like when you getting out. Classroom, or you in the bad intention? It's like them that, that scene in Gladiator when the niggas is all back there, nervous about going in there. Niggas yelling and shit. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna kill them niggas without going there. I said, oh, yeah, they gonna get you when you go in there. You you, you better get sacrificed, <laughs> man. Them niggas be oh, so no, I was I was I wasn't doing none of that. It was a- Go, yeah, I'm, a, I'm, nigga. This is fun. This is the best part of comedy, that, nigga. There ain't nowhere where you can have comedians just do the shit we do backstage. Nowhere else right. that y'all should they show it you, correctly. Can I tell you something? See, Ronnie is my guy. You know what I'm saying? Me and Ronnie are cool. Most of the niggas who I roast will, for the most part, I'm cool with because we have a rapport. A lot of times, niggas walk into the classroom with this energy, and you could just tell. You'd be like, hmm. Uh, yeah, yeah. It takes the fun. It, it takes the fun away. Like mm-hmm. I like I I genuinely enjoy getting roasted because like, I've been getting fat jokes since I was five, and you niggas be coming with new shit <laughs> still to this day. I'm no, like, I, you niggas is creative as fuck. Look, I came mm-hmm. back and told my mama every roast that you, I said, and me and CP said. And look, but look, you y- y'all didn't get to what Craig told me. That nigga went crazy. I was like, okay, guys, you this that nigga, yeah, Craig, shit, this nigga booger got seized. He, he grew a burger tree. Uh, but the nigga said a Big Mac <laughs> tree with fries on the side. Nigga, he said, look at that nigga said he was standing by the tree just looking at it. <laughs> I'm telling you, it'd be them act, it'd be the act house app of the jokes for me. I'll be like, nigga, that's but, like but to, CP to me, and Craig, like them niggas got that shit locked down. To me, it's the honor when a nigga got a well thought out, good ass roast. Cause you can just say shit to somebody, but Billy gonna have a good thought out roast. CP right. gonna have a good th- Brent Taylor go crazy. I'm nigga like, boo capone, nigga boo been killing all season. Boo go crazy. Hey. Why did they use it? Did, did they use when I said uh Doughboy be needing an appetizer in between the pay window and the pickup oh, yeah, window? Yeah, yeah. Goes, <laughs> <laughs> hey, you gotta run. You gotta run that one. That one was funny as hell too. Oh, that one is uh, that. I, I, said, taco, I said Doughboy be needing an appetizer in between the pay window and the food pickup window. Like, <laughs> y'all got any snacks I can do something? You know, like onion rings or something right now? Like. <laughs> <laughs> That's one thing about Joe Boy. Joe Boy can actually take a joke and he can give a joke. I feel I feel this season, Billy cannot really take jokes about him being gay like that. I noticed that Billy would be in some type of way along with uh they had a new guest that came on, I think, episode four, I believe. That felt, you could see in his face that it bothered him. I don't like persons like that. 
that show their emotion right, on their face when they're getting roasted because it looks like you're weak and you can't handle it. If you can't handle roast, don't go and roast me because you will get destroyed. Man, the time man, you know it's the time man, over. You are, man, hey, you Brandon. know it. Hey Brandon, the, shit, the, the fat shit CP make up, I be like, damn, that's a good idea. That's <laughs> 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 hey, hey, last hey, Ronnie, Ronnie be, be walking around the DMV with hors d'oeuvres and shit like, hey, nobody thought of this. Bigger <laughs> 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 rap dates, I'm about to kill him with this. Bigger rap dates. <laughs> How much they cost? Ninety-three dollars a piece, nigga. Ninety-three. How they free? How they free? I got seven hundred of them in the van. Go ahead, get your get your deal. Get your deal. Go ahead, get your beak. Get your beak wet. Get your beak wet. Bacon wrap. Hey, you know, hey, first you, you know, grab you a piece of meat, then you oh, throw it, it in the bowl. What did you say? What did you say? Lucas having fun. What happened? Grab a piece of meat. Don't let Booga Pong create a song of you because that will be a hit. That would be a hit. Oh my goodness. Booga Pona, so his jokes don't normally hit, but when it do hit, it's amazing. Did you put it did on the Did you throw it in the mud? Now, man, they lose the cookies. His facial expressions, and would it just be? It was just most random shit. Uh, I love it. Hey, yeah, I be, I was uh, back there doing my invoice, waiting on uh, waiting on y'all next. I was typing to her Booga Pona. I was like, and you know who had a good time too that, that did really well man I gotta give get a hat out to you man. Shima Franklin came in and did a good time oh, yeah, Shima, yeah. Yeah. Shima. Yeah, Shima came cause a lot of girls they have a hard time in there man cause you know this is ruthless dog. you know they get one joke or one thing you put this thing mm -hmm. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Oh, then, uh, turn your head to the left. Look at but the shima man. She just she, she fit. She fit. She froze hey, up, really. you know what's crazy? Yeah, you're you're right, really? Hey, we killed the girl the other way. I ain't gonna say no names, but she walked in. We fired her ass up. She walked right back out. You see that? <laughs> <laughs> she was like, "Oh no!" You know oh, no. She walked in, got her ass obliterated. It was like, "All right, cool." I walked right, 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 right. <laughs> oh, they didn't, even, they, didn't, they didn't dismiss her. She just left. Man, she walked in. We start. We, we nigga, she ain't make it to her seat like most people do. Like that's the thing, bro. You, you can't make it to your seat, man. We gotta fire up, fire yeah, up. Nigga. Ashima, we just had a Shima on the block. Right 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 right. Ashima came up in a. Everybody used to be in a Shima house after the comic club. Clayton, Carlos, uh, all the roasted niggas, Mario, Tori. So she always was in the in the circle of just killers anyway. So that, that you know who else? She can take it. She can absolutely take the you, jokes. She can take. You it. know who she else? You know who else been doing this shit this. This season is uh Tut Weezy. Touch been fun. Touch been, yeah, been, been killing. Yeah, he's been there, been, man. Been consistent. Like, yeah. yeah, he's been consistent. He's been good. He's been yeah. good. Touch, touch for sure standing his own in there. Cause, yeah, it's not easy. Even even of course being on the like I guess the tears or whatever the case when it comes to roasting, you know, he's there. He's he's staying yeah. consistent. That's even hard to do. Yeah. That's even harder to even make yeah. make especially with all them so all come back. in that classroom. Yeah, yeah man. he has nostrils he got, he's smelling everybody at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga not so like, still two bowls of, and then they got two big ass bowls of chili for for a nose. <laughs> <laughs> they got two lap shades. Then they got uh, he got first and seconds. Like yeah, I think when he got two bowls right now because game yeah, on. I just had to come back and get more chili. I don't feel like getting back up. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, shut up, nigga. Where, where that wisdom tooth at? <laughs> and if you look to your right side, you can see the wizard tooth hole where the wizard tooth used to be. The oh, hey, nigga, hey, the wizard, the wizard tooth finna get paid, nigga. Hey, call me WT, man. Oh, hey, don't, hey, hey, call me WT. <laughs> he got the, he got the call wizard. Call me WT, man. Yeah, <laughs> man. What is Bilo sleeping? <laughs> He's probably on his phone. Hey, don't worry, Wisdom Tooth is about to do a diss track against that nigga. Yeah, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> that, that nigga Wisdom Tooth. That nigga Wisdom Tooth plugged up USB so he get a better signal. He like, plug this motherfucker inside. <laughs> <laughs> hey, nigga, he be like working on the weekend like usual. <laughs> 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 <laughs 
Yeah. 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 They pass us. They chewing too much. <laughs> Working on the deep end like usual. Fighting on the deep end. One thing I noticed with Ronnie too, when um, when anybody cracking jokes on Ronnie, Ronnie, he, he doesn't have any rebuttal to give back to anybody. He just has to tag along with the joke about himself. If he noticed any of the roast, roasting, even in roast this, rewatch the videos and you'll, you'll see what I'm talking about. Ronnie doesn't have any rebuttal like that. I don't know why. You're on that video, life is good, man. I was the comedy writer on that video. Uh, what? Yeah, you out here getting busy in these writing streets, look, look, look at the credits. Look at the credits. Yeah, for sure. Then That's dope. Drake, That's Drake's dope. hands are weirdly soft. It's like. <laughs> you you a dap a nigga like, damn, bro, what what you using, a nigga? A lot of moisturization, huh? It was too much. Him and Fat Joe is weird. It's weird. It's like a lady. Like, nigga, you got girl hands. <laughs> what you think they doing, though? <laughs> what you think they doing, though? <laughs> like, they're not doing nothing, nigga. You know? <laughs> they're touching, touching money and women. That's what they doing, shit. Hey, hey, but Ronnie, shake, shake the boy with them two hands. See how hard or rough that is. What <laughs> <laughs> that nigga put in? That's your rugged. That nigga yeah, shit. Hey, he an old man. Now, I, I'm going to put a whole racket back here. I'm going to do a whole thing. <laughs> when I get my money from Doughboy, I'm going to I'm going to do a little skate ramp. <laughs> my wisdom tooth going to get a settlement, nigga? I'm going to get a skate ramp. <laughs> hey, hey. Wait. This is how they be looking up at the skate ramp. I'm going to do a skate ramp. <laughs> <laughs> Skate, here. It's gonna be real nice with a the theater in the middle. Yeah, he's gonna pay me. He's gonna pay me. He, gonna pay me. he got drunk one time and had to eat a plate. We was in the hospital for two days, fucking around with those boys. Oh my god. All right. Well, What's up, wanna... hey man, we gonna switch topics, man. Huh? He tearing your ass up, but we got the goddamn. <laughs> Yeah, we good. We good. We good. Oh, oh, hey. Yeah, we go back. Oh, my bad. My bad. Damn, my bad. We got a few more questions. We got a few more you okay. know what's funny, dog? That, man, this nigga, shit. <laughs> that nigga wisdom teeth, bro. God damn. That's a lot of, man, you got a lot of mouth, uh, though, boy. That's a lot of teeth. <laughs> like, how many, like, that? he got, like, great white layers of teeth. Like, the first outer core of wisdom wow. teeth. Wow. <laughs> that nigga, Billy, that right nigga got a surf, hey, though, boy, mouth look like he got a, a surfboard chunk in his back, back part back there, man. Like, I know, nigga. God hey, damn. Billy, Billy, think about all them young little teeth in there with no wisdom and no guidance. <laughs> 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 they got a do. They run into a Jolly Rancher or a Blow Pop. They, 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 they ain't been around. <laughs> Hey, 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 that nigga teeth got a class action lawsuit against his mouth. Are you tired of being a tooth and double his mouth? Are you tired of getting neglect? Are you tired of being pushed on hard, long days of work? Well, call us in this class action lawsuit with Smith and Hassler. Hey, hey, <laughs> no boy, no boy, no boy, front bottom teeth sound like this. I done been through a lot of bullshit. You know, <laughs> I done been through a lot of bu- I ate, I ate everything first. Uh, the wisdom tooth fuck and shit. I was down in there. I was down in there. Just been underneath the hot dog. Hey, not, not that glorious shit all the time. I'm coming through the bottom bread, straight meat. <laughs> Number, hey, number two. hey, I don't, I don't, hey, I don't touch no ketchup. You understand me? <laughs> you understand me? <laughs> you understand me? <laughs> you understand me? Hey, 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 hey they interviewed the, the two from the other side that's been separated from the other ones and two women. Yeah, right. y'all want to keep I, recapping? I, I, I want to move on to the, to the topics. That's all. Really, right, okay, it's up to y'all. It don't matter. We can keep going. Yeah, okay. get off my damn suit, nigga. Suit and dice. So we're in the alley. These are my real friends. Come on, let's go. <laughs> when, I started, when, I started, when I started in Doughboy's mouth in the bad position, they didn't understand the sacrifice we went through. They, they, not a no floss no no toothbrush. No hey, while he's talking, they saw him black and white pictures of, of your wisdom teeth growing up <laughs> back in the 40s. Oh, my God. Yeah, I, I, I realized. This is this where we got the right to vote right I'm here. I'm up in the yeah. yeah. so We got the right to right vote. All we did. Was he? All we did was he. <laughs> shit, play the clip, D. Play the clip. Tried, shit. I tried. Look at these niggas off the ass. All right, all right, come on, move on, move on, move on. I'm sorry. Every time this nigga remind me of that wisdom tooth, I gotta talk about WT. 
I can't. All right, let's keep going. God damn. Oh, all right. This nigga like he be break dancing on the subway. All right, ladies and gentlemen. And that boy raised by two whores. He <laughs> <laughs> got a cream shirt with two brown on it. All right, ladies and gentlemen. That was a clip. That was a clip. <laughs> That's all the clips. No, we got we got like five, six more. We can keep, oh, yeah, keep running that shit, man. That's okay, okay, I'll keep, I'll keep running them up. That was a that smaller yeah, clip there. Just wanted to let y'all know that was okay, up there. Yeah, yeah, I got another one on the way. Hold on, let me get moving on. I think we about to. I, I think Billy got that damn Delta suit on. Yeah, you know, I, I work for Delta. I fly for Delta. I get here for Delta. Just cross Delta. <laughs> Nigga, look like he said goodbye. <laughs> Nigga, like he said goodbye with jazz hands. Just. That nigga said I didn't cross Delta. That was I funny. just crossed. That's, funny. That's funny. Billy okay. look like he said children. Like, Whose children are these? Whose children are these? <laughs> <laughs> Whose children are these? He like he about to say, I'm doing a local store down at the Gazette. <laughs> but what about the children? <laughs> <laughs> Billy about to do a promposal right there. That's what he about to do. Uh, uh, <laughs> all right, what's the next clip? What's the next clip? Next clip, I got you right here. It's going to be, uh, I'm going to play it. I'm just going to let it play. Cause I, I'm pretty sure we're about to get into uh, uh, re- <laughs> oh, yeah. a re- Let me check. We got a body suit and jeans on. He put that shit on and it really felt like food. This is what it's gonna be. They got no scuba gear. That nigga's nipple bleeding. Hold that thought, hold that thought. I gotta bring somebody to the glass. Come in! It's a class. All the way from Boston, Massachusetts. Y'all get it. It is Rito. It's Rito. Woo! Deep jokes coming soon. We need a food jersey. (laughs) 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 That was a clip. Hey, what was so funny is. The jersey had nothing to do with it, but nothing. as soon as you said Winnie the Pooh, nigga, you made so nigga, much like, oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Rito was feeling like it was finna roll up when he said Winnie the Pooh, too. Like, that <laughs> nigga so Winnie the Pooh out. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. That was fucking funny. All right, here we go. We got the next one up. Let's go. This one, Ronnie Jordan makes it to the hot seat. This oh, one, right? no. Oh, yeah. was like, no. Mr. Beatty's himself. You get down, Beatty's. You got to face round in the final <laughs> number. Okay. <laughs> so the back stage is down there. Dive him, sugar. Dive him, sugar. Dive him, sugar. <laughs> <laughs> I need to eat ice cream after breakfast. <laughs> Oh god! Die from sugar! Die from sugar! Die from sugar! That's so fucking random. Die from sugar! Die from sugar! God damn! My kids gotta see this. You see this shit? Oh Oh, man! (laughs) Mr. Beatty's himself. When you get diabetes, you gotta face the final boss. (laughs) (laughs) Nigga, die from sugar! Die from sugar! Die from sugar! I'm in diabetes vendetta, nigga. Oh, that's so God. funny, bro. Uh, <laughs> God damn, man. All right, next clip. Brent looked like from oh, shit. He said, He said, What? Hold on, let me rewind. Let me rewind. Hold on, hold on. What happened? Who said what? I got you. Hold on. I'm going to get him right here. You like you got in there. Like a pillow Hey, Brandon, like you look like you're going to the strip club. Move, 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 ladies. Move, move, move. I got it. I got it. Move, move, move. Move, ladies. I got your money. <laughs> <laughs> that's funny as hell because that's true. <laughs> Oh my goodness. All right. Few no, more. Ronnie Few came more. out there cooking though. He held his yeah, own. Ronnie was there, yeah. man. Ronnie was there. Shout out to Ronnie Merch fit. He, 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 he Merch held fit, set it off and got no goddamn excuse. That nigga <laughs> he held his own, and that's a lot to hold because he's a lot yeah. of a nigga. Yeah. Nigga, you stop having fat jokes, no boy. This nigga Fuck just that. lost fifteen percent of his teeth, nigga. Y'all gotta remanage some shit, nigga. That was, that was a lot of your body's business. Was, 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 was a lot of the business. You a big guy, but y'all gonna lose a lot of volume. Y'all lose a lot of volume. Well, that, no, no boy lost all that. A lot of volume. No boy lost all that weight. 
Those boy had lost all that weight. He got his uh, skin in the ponytail under that shirt. <laughs> that nigga teeth went on strike, and that's why he lost all that weight. <laughs> I'm nigga, not doing you today. We will not chew. We will not chew. We will not choose. Then that's when that's when the news came down there. They was interviewing the team. What happened? It was a cow zone. And he a cow zone. He bit a whole cow zone. He put a jolly ranch in there this time. Put all that shit in cow zones. They got a cow zone with a bunch of ice cubes in it. He crazy. Back to you down in the studio. He got a cow zone full of ice cubes. That's good. That's good. Hey, CP, if you're just joining us now, we're inside the the two cavity of Doughboy. This is is, is two stadium. Uh, Yeah, yeah, yeah. Billy, if you can hear me, there's a Shame what they found. Now, you <laughs> <laughs> two got an atrium inside. God damn! If this is, if you come down here, this is where the this is where the mayhem all started. They said it was a pizza party, as <laughs> ice cream party. Yeah, and yeah. Then, hey and Billy, then the mayhem continued. Yeah. Hey Billy, talk about the yeah. two bodies they found. Apparently, <laughs> the theory has never come. There have been two bodies. Yeah. There are two it was, it was bodies funny. in there. It was everywhere. Carnage everywhere. If you can see here, there were bodies as far as the eye could see. And they say it started around here around six o'clock when Doughboy went into a sugar uh, manic coma uh, aggressive rate. We got a witness here who said he saw it. Did you see what happened out here? Yeah. It was crazy. Now, about what time did all the cow zones and pizzas start getting eaten? Oh my! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. I got security here. It's, it's, it's crazy down here. Wow. <laughs> now, we're now, we're that way. Uh, you two stay in backstage. Why did they got a gold Bluetooth speaker? First of all, nigga, <laughs> calm down, Odell Beckham. With that goddamn gold Bluetooth speaker. Hey, appreciate you, man. Billy just got hey, 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 Billy, Billy. What about yeah. when they said that the perpetrator apparently was biting Pepsi cans? Biting them open like apples <laughs> around yeah, the SoFi Stadium. It started right here. You can see right here in this chicken and concrete <laughs> where he started biting into the stairs. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I hate you, niggas. <laughs> <laughs> All of you. They're calling it Dozilla. That's, that's what they're naming this storm. It's Dozilla. He climbed the Coca Cola Tower and popped the top on that bitch and he drank the people. He drank the people. Oh my goodness! All right, all right. wait, wait, all right. wait, Billy, Billy. So they're so they're telling you that there's more. Yeah, it is. If we can get closer, <laughs> we're gonna go inside and take a closer look. Uh, oh, oh my god! god. Oh my god! Only on, only on roast me TV where we're gonna take you. Inside. Oh my god! Oh my god! Right now, if you're tuning in right now to Capping, make sure you subscribe, like, and share this right now because this is informative information going around, and it's a podcast called Roast This. So right now, tell a friend to tell a friend to follow the all their page so you can get more of this breaking news. Back hey, to Billy, you, Billy. Hey, hey, Billy, please be careful down there. Be a little we got another, we got another great He's killing here. We're, we're trying to keep the going. Oh, 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 oh. Here. <laughs> Tell him what happened. Backstage right now with all the fun. <laughs> wait, 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 you got to let me back here. You got to tell us what happened to Billy Boy's too. Hey, these are some people that work inside your boy mouth. Without these janitors, please. You think he's brushing these teeth? No, he got full janitors in there. Without these janitors cleaning up this God mouth, damn God, you, God, you God, niggas. Not <laughs> oh. Oh Which my y'all God. just how was an improv class for you? What, what's what's crazy is no boy got a concert. Improv-ing. His teeth doing a uh, doing a, doing a concert called Chuchella. <laughs> Come on down to Chuchella. We're going to show you how it's really done. Wait, 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 wait. Here it is. Here it is. Chuchella, nigga. I thought it was, yeah, I thought it was Netflix. Hey, wait, wait, wait. Here, here it is. Here it is, CP. Here it is, CP. Coming to you right here at Chuchella. Is that the biggest Jolly Rancher in America right now? <laughs> actually, if anybody's watching at home, it looks like a monitor is actually a cake. <laughs> this is this is is it a cake season three? 
<laughs> Only no <laughs> boy can tell. <laughs> so Billy, Billy, they're saying that that's a crime rate. Apparently, someone is taking a bite out of crime, and they believe it was no boy. <laughs> You know, not all heroes wear capes. Some of them wear cake. They don't. He doesn't wear a cape. He wears a cape, ladies and gentlemen. That's right. Oh, wear, wear a cape. Oh, shit. Oh, my cheeks hurt. Oh, oh, my bad. Oh, hey, hey, oh hey. my God. I can't go hey, hold on. Oh, this is pretty cool. Hey, if you ain't seen it, look at this. That's pretty cool. That's hard. Oh, yeah, that's, that's lit. Hard. That's lit. Yeah, that's hard. Yeah, that's hard. Oh, it's 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 show, it show, it show you both sides of your bullshit suit. <laughs> <laughs> you see that bullshit suit in 4K? <laughs> That's so bullshit over here. You forgot how to look at the back. It's a view of the bullshit. It's a view. And if you look closer, guys, if you look a little bit closer, five comedians whose career is going nowhere. All right here in one place with, that, uh, with the commercial on it. <laughs> oh, All right. All right, let's get let's just get into some topics. I can't go back to the road after that. You know it's funny because it. Billy, Billy keeps some spice on his jokes. It's so funny. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm not sure if y'all heard about the Spirit and Frontier connection. Uh, they're trying to yeah. The top, to join. the top, the top one's carrying Doughboy. The bottom is carrying all the rest of the So hey, this, hey, this is hey, this is what it looked like when Ronnie and Doughboy got to fly at the same time. Like, <laughs> 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 you got a two seat hey, jet. Hey, two hey, 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 hey! A Krispy Kreme light just turned on in Utah. Them niggas is racing to it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 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 wait, 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 CP, if you look a little closer, you're going to see a building with Doughboy and Ronnie on top of it about to knock the planes down. Hey, hold on, Billy, Billy. <laughs> hey, Billy, if you look yeah. real close, if you look real close, Ronnie is in first class and coach. <laughs> hey, listen, listen, hey, if you look a little bit closer, you can see B. Lewis and his mouth hanging on on the back wing on the bottom plane. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Ooh, boy, y'all. Yeah. Hey, fuck it. Yeah. Come on, man. Anyway, what happened? What's, with what's, this, what's the story? What is it? What so, is it? so they they were trying to partner, uh, and then JetBlue jumped in, trying to get with Spirit instead to to, to uh, kind of get this separated. It's not, JetBlue was trying to pretty much buy out Spirit. Uh, Spirit pretty much said no. So for hey, whatever reason, they said no. They don't hey, want to go. They want to do know Spirit why? Frontier. You know right? why? You know what? You know you got to be doing bad for Spirit to turn your money down. But what? Like, nah, You're right? Right? <laughs> they are both trash. Jet Blue and Spirit are both trash. Who would want to fly either one of those? Or, I thought Jet uh, Blue was all right. Jet Blue's okay. Jet, Jet, Jet Blue okay. better than Spirit. Easily. Easily. But the thing, hey, the thing Spirit is, is terrible. terrible. Spirit's off. That's the worst one. Hey, right, don't boy, how many seats do you got to pay for on Jet Blue when you fly? Is it two oh, more? Let you get that. Shut the your ass up. <laughs> <laughs> Billy, you look, like the, you look like the leader of all the flight attendants, nigga. You look like the you look like you train everybody. Nigga. If you go here, 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 here go the exit, and they go to the bad bitch section right over there. Right hey, over backstage. There. <laughs> backstage. All right, well, Billy says Billy's still out there doing things. We're going to move on to the next, next thing. Right. I just wanted, y'all want to talk about this one, or y'all good on this one? Are we no, good on that one, man. Oh, this one. Cool. This one pretty good. This one pretty good. Uh, the former CNA. Uh, she was a convicted felon, and then she went a millionaire by selling scrubs and opened a wholesale division to give others the same opportunity. So, wow. convicted felon, as you That's see, amazing. but she obviously flipped that. Yeah, got out. She and, yeah. So she just oh, started what? selling. Just that's dope as hell. But she just started selling like custom, custom scrubs. Yeah, I guess so. I mean, of course, the CNA stuff is is big. You know what I mean? Like that stuff. Is, a lot big. of CNA. Bro, that's not the same person, bro. That is it, it's the same person. That's not the it same looks like person, a different one. Yeah, that, it looks different. The lady on well, here is the same color it. as them seats. The lady down in the thing right. is Lupita. That's the thing with makeup. Makeup will make a, whole, a woman different. And she looked like she put on a little bit of weight. So that's the same person. But it, it, it's good that she turned her life around. <laughs> right, that is not the same lady. She got a glow up, on, man. I know we're coming in dark, dark on your side. She got a glow up. She got a glow up when she got out. Can I tell y'all? First thing she did was kill the real person that took over her life. But that's damn right. near her. <laughs> that is not the same person. They say, they, say, they say in the chat is makeups and look exactly alike. I was going off the chats and caffeine. I see y'all in the caffeine chat. She's yeah, the one who make all them yeah, scrubs for them, them thick white girls with that uh with that T-Boz haircut. All the white CNAs in Georgia thick as hell like black girls 
Yeah, she make the scrub for all the big booty CNAs. Shout out to all the big booty CNAs. It could be some so big booty her? CNAs and registered nurses. Back. So what's yep. up with her scrubs? Why are they so special? It, it look like her scrubs do the do the little camel toe. That's sweet. I think <laughs> yeah, because you know I think the regular scrubs wasn't fitting our curvy women. I yeah, think oh, exactly. more than the market, oh, you know okay. what I'm saying? Okay. Yeah. So that's that's get you that get you a Rolls Royce. You see what what the market need to give them some shit. You she know, got a Rolls Royce, motherfucker. Though I wouldn't mind a chick wearing the scrubs even if she wasn't a doctor. That shit. Wait, just she got she became a millionaire though. That's a lot of just, fucking just, scrubs. Exactly. Just scrubs like, baby. A whole millionaire off of that. That's dope. That's a lot of scrubs, bro. That's dope, man. That's dope. They don't look no different than regular scrubs. They must fit different. That must be the. It, the it must be the fit. It must be the fit. You right. gotta be. You gotta like, of course. They probably my, stretchy. They probably stretchy yeah. as hell. I like that. They probably yeah. stretchy as hell. A little, yeah. little tight little scrub. Scrub the ground. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> you ever go to the doctor with your kids and the nurse be thick? You be sitting there trying not to look. Hell yeah. You yeah, yeah, be no, going hey. to the doctor. You <laughs> <laughs> be going to the doctor. <laughs> Hey, go to the doctor for anything. <laughs> we bet you do, nigga. Hey, uh, I can't get my kneecap again. I lost my kneecap again. I lost my kneecap now. We go, boy. We keep telling you. <laughs> start at your foot. Hey. <laughs> go up three teeth spaces and then start to feel. I can't find my kneecap, man. It's scaring me. <laughs> Put this apple tag on it. Put the apple I need tag an IV. I need an IV. You don't need an IV, though, boy. I do need an IV. I'm thirsty. I need an IV with Mountain Dew in it. <laughs> you really got a flaming, you really got a flaming hot Cheeto version of Mountain Dew? Hey, yes, that's disgusting. Wow, that is pretty goddamn. Wait, why, you do you, why, do you, why do you get all the snack emails? Hey, 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 I will say this: perfect segue. I would never do this to y'all, but perfect segue. Did y'all hear about this one? Wow. What yeah. the fuck? About this I one? heard about this. This is crazy. Wait, what? Look, hold on, this could hit. Here go the thing, though. Here go the thing that's fucking me up, right? Y'all know how they put fruit in cereal, right? Like, right. like, like dry strawberries and fruit. Right. They could, they could literally have a whole dried fruit cereal. These niggas, they going with oats to put in orange juice. If they did like a whole fried like strawberries, bananas, and blueberries as just the crunch, and you put orange juice on it, that'll be lit. Oh, you need milk in cereal. What the hell is wrong with you? Yeah, That's gonna be weird and nasty. You, bro. Orange right. juice as the milk, nigga. Orange juice in a spoon, nigga. Never. It's pretty gross. That's, That's, too, much nasty, That's too much citric acid. It's pretty nasty, CP. It's like, it's like, well, the best way to get heartburn right? <laughs> in the morning. Okay. All right. Let's, 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 hold on. 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 Chopper Cannon said that they understand that this might not be for everybody, which means that what they want people to do is try it once, hate it, and they're going to get a big-ass pull-in. What I'm telling y'all is this. Fruit juice cereal, if you put it with dried fruit and that's it, that would be like a smoothie and that would be lit. I'm I telling see, you. I see, okay, okay. Oh, no, you see, go wait, 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 wait. You what you that now? Like dried mango, dried strawberries, over you orange. Dried mango, dried uh, strawberries, dried pineapple, Bananos, dried bananas. banana, dried blueberries. And then you, and then you add the juice. And, mix. and then you and add the juice. juice. Right, right, right. Did, did I and just go good. to Jamba Juice, nigga? Why would I just... It's <laughs> <laughs> a fucking smoothie. No, no fucking cereal. This is weird. This is weird as hell. It's the only breakfast you can have. This nigga did this girl. I'm making a smoothie. First, 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 you put some ice in there. <laughs> then you put some fruit. And then you put some, some yogurt. And then, and then, and then, <laughs> Lewis, man. You can Why add you walk me into food. it? Nigga said, what else is it good? Right. Ooh, yeah. What else is it? <laughs> he said, nigga, I don't... <laughs> Pull the rug. Oh, that's the that, that sounds disgusting. That sounds almost as bad as the Sour Patch cereal that they came out with. Oh, they came out with a Sour boy. Patch cereal. Wow. So that time that I saw you at IHOP ordering a Budweiser omelet, that, <laughs> that, don't, that don't count. <laughs> that don't count. <laughs> that don't count, huh? Using your drinking day. Nah. Can I get two Budweiser <laughs> omelets, please. Uh, <laughs> what, co what come on the side of a Budweiser omelet? What is a donut. <laughs> 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 oh shit! God, I'm not trying that shit. That shit looks disgusting. And I, 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 mean, I usually try anything once, but I'm not trying. Or hey. that's just that's just weird. You know how, that's just, you know I how try it. You know I try it. I just ain't gonna buy it. You ever brush your teeth? I try it. I just ain't gonna buy it. You ever, you ever, you ever, you ever brush your teeth and then hit the orange juice? And oh, oh man! That's just oh, this oh, I the picture. I was like, <laughs> ah, that's cool. I'm not. That That's too much vitamin C in one thing for me. Right, right. All right. Next little That's little cool. topic, real quick. We'll keep I mean, moving on. You got we'll your back tooth. It's gonna hurt. Wiz Khalifa. 
Uh, Wiz Khalifa uh, is is said, or I guess, and I guess in a recent interview has said that he likes to be uh, told to what to do by his uh, female counterpart. He likes to be told what to do. I, you know, it, do y'all actually, you know, of course, a lot of y'all was married. crazy. I thought her hair was gray, but that's smoke. God damn, that's, that's <laughs> where that's where smoke. That dude is smoking. No. So, how do y'all feel about that? As you got a lot of y'all married. Pussy like, nigga. Now, I don't mind it. Yeah, I don't mind it either. That should be fun. You know, they can't really tell you what to do, but when you right. act like it, it's, it's like it's a fun thing. Yeah, nah. That nigga wife right I, I, next I, I, to him, man. Hey, man, that one don't count, man. CPO let it right next to him. Hey, look at that. Hey, look at that. It's cool. It's cool. Hey, that'd be fun. It'd be like this. Hey, bro. Hey, hey. It's, it's, it's cool to a certain extent, but hell no. Nah. That's why. No, I don't, if, no. if y'all remember Slim, Slim and Queen, what was it? Queen and Slim. That's what happened when yeah. you let a woman lead you. Motherfucker got caught. They talking about in the bed. Yeah, we ain't talking about goes. running from the police and shooting somebody. That's Shut up, be little bit of like. Don't tell me what bank to go to, bitch. I go to my own bank. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell me what's been turned down. I know how to grab. All right, nigga, relax. Relax. I guess it's cool. I guess it's cool if a woman tells you what to do. It's just how she do it. Like I can't, I can't have a woman talking to me crazy. But if she's saying like respectfully, it's cool. It, yeah. It's like you know to a certain level, but I mean, not just on some all the time hey, shit. Like hey, nigga. Hey, but, hey, so if you at Sizzler and your girl be like, "Duh, boy, it's time to go. We've been here for four <laughs> hours." You're like, "Fuck you, bitch! You don't tell me what to do." I knew it. I knew it. No, let me tell you about speaking of Sizzler, which is a travesty. They wait, 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 how many times? No, are nigga, are you serious? But look, how many times it's you gonna fun. have sex like, with your girl? Oh, you over... doing the water? Yeah, hey, let's go one at a time. Let's go one at a time. How many Ronnie, times? Ronnie, you gonna you go ahead. How many Ronnie, times go you gonna have sex with your girl over the lifetime? I've been with my wife. We've been married seventeen years. We've been together nineteen years. You gonna have to switch it up at some point. So let her tell you what to do might be the move that time. You know what I'm saying? I don't, I don't no, see boy, no problem look at what you telling yourself to do got you into. Your shoulders are little and your body big. <laughs> Somebody needed to tell you that that boy stop. At least he's standing up. That boy look like he been eating upside down. <laughs> oh shit! Nah, listen, this is this is my this is my take on it. If I'm in a relationship with a woman, I gotta it can't be 50 50. It gotta be 51 49 to your boy. So as long as she know that at the end of the day, I got the last say. Cool. I might just once in a while be like, all right, you can say some shit, but it gotta be 51 49 with a nigga like. So. Hey, dope boy, you and your girl Thanks, be man. pretty sucking 69, and don't y'all? Like, yeah, we're going to see who really the boss. <laughs> I got double D's. You got double D's. <laughs> Bitch, you know what time it is. Don't say that to no Timmy. <laughs> hey, people, hey, I, I don't know why people, uh, like, I don't know, bro. This shit is a touchy topic. It ain't touchy, but it's just like, damn, it's everybody got an topic. opinion, it's man. Everybody be Lou. Be Lou, how long you been with your girl? I've been with yeah, my little probably next. like eight years. Okay, so okay. every time it got to be the way you want to, every time. No, it ain't every time. But look, see this. See y'all going and see. No, I'm just asking. I'm just asking. No, 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 no. You like right? No, it don't gotta always go the way I want it to go. And I, and I don't and I don't uh fight for that. You know what I'm saying? Like hey, every time we get to an argument because I don't get my way. No, but it's just like for the overall trajectory of the relationship, the high. I think they're getting this misconstrued. I don't think there's nothing wrong with a female actually guiding um, their loved one or person that they're interested in because they're only looking out for the best interest. Because if you're in a relationship wise, right, a female m may know certain things that a man may not know. So she may tell a man to do something that would benefit or two of them, you know, in the long run, and it's the man to accept it or disagree with it. It's just my opinion. I don't know. Hierarchy of the relationship, the hierarchy in the kingdom, it has to be organization and it has to be roles. 
That's your pride, think, bro. Think, yeah. 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 No, he's telling the truth. That's telling the fucking truth. It's Thank old school shit. That's old it's shit. like a man got to be a leader. Men are not followers. You can't follow a woman. Like, I'm not saying that in a disrespectful way, but I'm like, we're, 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 meant, to, bro, we're meant to be leaders. Can I say this real quick? We're meant quick? to be I'll leaders, get, nigga. Can okay, I say this real quick before I get back? Look, bro. It's not about whole, following, we'll right? Oh, my God. You, Pan the camera you, first, nigga. Pan the camera first. If you come into yeah, my girl right here. If you come into a relationship <laughs> with the attitude that you never gonna listen to her, then what's the point of having a girl, bro? Like you need somebody to like it's like it's just like this. It's like it's like having a co-pilot. Nigga, they they know they 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 need to know all the responsibilities of being a real pilot. So that if something happened to you, nigga, then you good. You know what I'm saying? It's right. like, bro, y'all want to be a pilot, and then you fuck around, and get sick, and your girl all the way back in coach. She don't know what the fuck to do. She don't no, know how to do that nah. shit. He got my he gonna, he gonna, just... he gonna think I thought of. Uh, organization seems like GP is the nail on the coffin right there. This argument should end it right there, but man, control to someone who is disorganized, and a lot of Ooh. women are disorganized. So okay. meaning that they have a lot of thoughts and they can't necessarily make that one thought because they're like, oh, well, maybe this, or maybe that, or maybe this, or maybe that. And men, we have a simple mind to like, yes, yes or look. no, black or white. Like we're gonna go this way and, and then, then if, the, if the ship sink, then my nigga, we gotta leave this decision. I'll give you a perfect example. This happens all the time when men and women go out to eat. Like when it's time to go out to eat and that's a decision that gotta be made. Now it's like, what do you wanna do? Oh, y'all can sit there all night trying to figure out, a, it's the man, like a, somebody's gonna have to make an executive decision. Of course you wanna think about your woman, you wanna make your woman happy, you want all of that, you wanna think about all the things, but somebody's gonna have to make a decision or y'all might not eat that night. That's what I'm saying. So somebody needs to be able to just reel it. Okay, okay. I'm going to end it right here. I think I heard enough. I think I already heard enough my thoughts. The video is really interesting, but the last topic of discussion where they where they feel as though it is weird to get seek advice or be told to do something by a female. That is totally wrong. I don't feel as though that is an issue. I think that is a male pride because we feel as though we have to have the answers for everything. Not every time we're going to have the answers for everything. We must be able to seek the answers from other people. Sometimes that's what makes a leader a leader if you listen. That's why we have two ears and one mouth. We don't have to have the answers for everything all the time. But once we're there, once we show confidence, once we show support and love, we can be able to do a lot of things together. That's why a, a successful relationship lasts long. Well, this is Steph Biox. Until next time, peace. Oh, and one more thing, I will be posting more videos, so be, please be on the lookout for more content. This is something that I am implementing to make sure that I have commentary and my opinions on videos so i'll be able to get monetized in the future so this is why i decided to do this format hopefully you guys are loving it and uh, please let me know um if you have any suggestions on what i can do to improve the video so i can at least try it out I have no problem with getting positive or negative feedback, so please let me know, and I would really, really appreciate it. Thank you, guys.